Well, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Hope you're all doing great and welcome to this new video in which we will talk about token unlocks, all right? Uh, specifically for three projects which uh, have big token unlocks pretty soon or at least in the in the next couple of months uh, we'll talk about them. i mean in, in general the the main value that you have with this is that you you know uh that the co these coins will be volatile all right so or at least i mean usually like a, a token unlock if you if you don't know what it what it is is basically it is uh, well i looked it up um it's a process where previously locked tokens are moved into private crypto wallets of initial investors team members partners uh advisors and become freely tradable in the market all right so let's say uh, binance labs invests in a project um and they get 10 uh, percent of the supply for that then uh, they, they won't have those tokens like initially at some point of time like they say okay after two years you get your tokens um, and then they will get the tokens and that's what a token unlock is right so basically that's usually investors etc uh, get their tokens so that's obvious uh, i mean look the the obvious thing is that you would short before that all right not when it happens well when it happens it's also possible but you will you you will short before it all right because you think that when the investors get their tokens they will sell all right so sometimes when they get a lot of the tokens that's a great area to short but in general and we'll talk about that as well just in this video sometimes that's also a good moment uh, to actually long one week before because sometimes what you have like everybody knows these token unlocks are coming uh, so a lot of people short if a lot of people short they can get squeezed out all right so we'll talk about these these projects uh, in this in this video that have big unlocks and now I'll, I'll tell you what what i think the the best trade is all right first one is mode um now if you don't know mode it's an ethereum layer 2 has not performed very well it's a very weak crypto at this point of time it's also a small crypto but you can trade it on most exchanges um it's uh well in general for, for me like like they're unlocking a ton of tokens today but also uh september the 5th all right so september the 5th um a lot of like like they'll have a, a big airdrop again but apart from that also the foundation will get a lot of um uh, a lot of airdrops and developers will get a lot of airdrops like developers they created the de decentralized applications they will need some money all right for that so it's very likely this will be a sell um and that's in, combina in combination with that mode in terms of the the, the network itself um, but also the price, um, I don't think this will do well with the unlocks, all right? Basically, everything about this looks bearish since the start. It is a possibility that we'll have some sort of a redemption rally. That is possible, so I, I would not blindly short this, uh, but I'm pretty sure that after the unlocks, in this case, we will see more bearish momentum, all right? Regardless of what the market does. Um, so that's mode, all right? So like I said, 5th of September, big unlocks already has big unlocks right now but uh, but well that's not the video uh 5th of september extra big unlocks um has already been very weak network is declining uh so this is probably a short for me all right unless we see some sort of a short squeezing move now the second one is perhaps the biggest one we will see this year and that is celestia all right so celestia this is a bit more in the future it's the 31st of october we will have massive unlocks all right uh, with with basically only investors getting their tokens and these investors and and don't <laughs> if, if you see this don't uh, don't get a heart attack uh, but these investors have been able to buy their tokens at ridiculously low prices all right the seed round was at one cent um celestia right now is at like four dollars and sixty cents so they're up uh 464 x the series A was at 10 cents and the series B was at $1. So all of these investors are, are up. Um, there have been OTC sales as well, where basically these investors have already sold their tokens uh, over, over the counter. But I cannot believe, like, like those OTC sales were also at, at a much, much lower price than the current price. Um, so I cannot believe that we will not see a sell effect or, or a big dump after these um after these unlocks but again and we have seen this in the past with celestia like celestia actually has seen some some bigger rallies so with celestia i actually am tempted to long before the unlocks when you see the initial signs and i will keep you updated on this so don't worry too much about this um, but when you see the early signs of a short squeeze because i do think 
um, with the amount of investors and, and backers behind Celestia and the amount of volume they do, like th this is a, a big project, all right? I do think we'll see one, one big rally, one big short squeeze before, and then eventually a dump when the unlock has actually happened. All right, so I, I think you can both long this and short this, um, but that very much depends on what happens at that point of time, all right? Um, so yeah, that's Celestia, big unlock. Like, like this is this is perhaps one of the most famous unlocks uh, coming coming this year. But the last one is a little bit different, and that is Worldcoin. All right, so this is not one big unlock that's coming, um, but what is coming is that uh, TFH investors have very recently started to get their tokens. All right, so Worldcoin, if you don't know, it's it's this coin, it's, it's the AI coin with, with the orbs where you have to scan in your eyes and you get tokens. Um, and this coin at this point of time, like very recently, the, the investors behind this also have gotten their tokens. Um, but but there's, no, there, there's no set date um, after which people will get their tokens. But the daily unlocks, the daily emissions of WLD to coins right now is so ridiculously high that, I mean, this is like a guaranteed short, all right? They're, like the, the emissions per week right now are over $30 million, all right? So over $30 million in WL WLD tokens are being unlocked, which leads to a chart like this. Uh, we've gone from March from 11.7 down to $1.7 right now. And I think this can go much, much lower. Now, uh, so shorts are the main direction I would look for, for, for this coin. Now, the thing is, kind of similar as with Celestia, th this coin has some short squeezes. All right. So as you can see, historically, we've seen some, some big spikes up. Um, I think this is a guaranteed short, but I would wait for one of those manipulated short squeeze rallies before entering. Um, but Worldcoin, the project that it is with the daily emissions that they have, I mean, this is unsustainable. All right. Um, so definitely don't buy this spot. Um, you can try to play the short squeeze again, but it's going to be risky. All right. So those are my thoughts. Those are the three projects. Worldcoin, like I said, already doing it right now. Also, when you're watching this video, Celestia, it's the 31st of October. Mode, it's the 5th of September, but it's already re relatively bearish now as well. All right, so I will try to keep you updated on that. For now, that's what you need to know. Uh, if you do have any questions, let me know down in the comments. But for now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.